Um, well, the weather will eventually turn for the better. Patrick Laine won't? No, Patrick Laine will. Right. Like, the, this is the... Because Patrick Laine is the streakiest superstar in the game of hockey today. Is it not, I think that's a fair assessment of Patrick well, but like, Laine. I feel like, and let me just say this, and I'm not... You're right. We throw around the word superstar really quick these days. I heard franchise player about guys that are being rumored to be on the move at the deadline. I feel like the media throws out superstar and franchise player way too easily. And in my mind, he's not at superstar level yet because if he goes cold, as maybe we saw in the playoffs, you have to affect the game in a different way. But you're right. Like, 44 goals in this day and age is a really, really good player. Is it a superstar? I don't know, 100 goals before the age of 21? Like, I mean, I, I would put him there, yeah. Like, I know what you're saying. Got, real superstars have done more in their careers. Yeah. But he reeks of a superstar to me. 18 goals in a month. When you have the capability of scoring 18 times a month, and after 10 goals, people know what's up. In November, you're hot. Cover you differently. Okay, but then Do different you, scheming but against you, Patrick Lina. He's still got 18 goals in November. You can't have one goal in January and three in December and be a superstar, can you? You can be, yes. I see, I think you can. That's where I disagree with you. He, I believe he's a superstar. So since that 18 he games, he has what, four goals? Uh, four goals since the end of November. He has yes. two goals in 18 games? Yeah. And he doesn't do a heck of a lot else. No. That's My guy correct. was a dash three in Philadelphia. Correct. Sorry, one goal in eight. In 12 games, two goals. He's in struggling. Right, he's struggling. Yeah. I got it. This is that like you can't be a superstar and do that in my mind. Okay. And I'm not saying he won't get there. I'm just we're ready to anoint right away. And sometimes guys aren't ready to be that guy yet. And I look at Patrick Line and say, the Jets don't need him to be that guy as much as other teams do because they have a bunch well, of but very gifted players. Hold on, let me finish. But when it comes to the playoffs and you struggle and you don't affect the game in any other way, then you're not a superstar in my books. I'm yeah, sorry. That's where I was going. To. I'm not like saying he, that he's not going to get there. Winnipeg, don't put words into my mouth. I'm not saying that. I'm saying right now, I don't know if he's that guy. Yeah, I mean, that. Like, let's remember the postseason a year ago. Yes. This was not his best moment. And uh, I, I hear everything you're saying, Timmy. What, but what worry, the only thing that worries me about him is that I believe no one is harder on Patrick Liney than Patrick Liney. Oh, without a doubt. Paul Maurice has gone down this road numerous times to the media. You could, the quotes, we have multiple quotes from this kid saying that he sucks and he's forgotten how to play the game of hockey. And obviously he has it because he nearly won a, a Rocket Richard trophy a year ago. Right. So he's pretty damn good. Right. I just, I just think he needs to get out of his own way and occasionally, if you're not scoring, that's fine. You got to try and do those other things. If you're not going to score, you got to affect the game in some way. He still has 25 goals. He does. Which is crazy. And 18 of them came in November. Right. But he, he's not doing those other things, which makes it really easy for Paul Maurice to go not tonight. Right. Which is what happened last night in Boston. And they still won because they're a pretty damn deep hockey team right. with some real guys. And there may not be done adding between now and the deadline. I am not panicking the way some people may be panicking. I think this kid is going to pull out of this. He's going to be good. He's going to learn from this. And I think he's going to have a way better postseason this year than he did a year ago. Well,